The pages of history are littered with brilliant victors and foolish losers. But foolish victors and brilliant losers are in much more exclusive company. I am not so arrogant as to call myself brilliant. Others can do that for me, if they deem it just. But I am no fool, and my instincts have been sharpened by decades of fighting. When a shark smells blood in the water, it attacks mercilessly. When news reached me of the civil war in Parthia, I resolved to do the same. A pang of pity for Osros struck me as I recalled the strife of my youth. But now that fortune has given me a chance to put a decisive end to an age-old rivalry, I cannot hesitate. Rome knows two great seas today, but tomorrow it will know a third. We will seize Tessiphon, the jewel of Parthia, and stride onwards in the footsteps of Alexander until my legions glimpse the ocean. If I succeed, I hope that history will remember Osros as a brilliant loser. But how will I be remembered? How will Hadrian? How will Rome? I will lead my forces down the Tigris, Emperor. We shall meet by the Rock sea. <laughs> we are deep in enemy territory. Must seize a forward base from the Parthians. Thank <laughs> you. 
Carthian town is ours. We can set up camp here, but we will have to seize more towns to access more types of weapons. This is as fine a foothold as any. Rogan? Oklahoma? On this. I saw Alamas. Rock evil, Tardy. Some rock owner. Habitat directors. Habitat summer directors. Rogan? Alamas. Rogan? I saw. Yuri? Oh, 
numbers. Last time you faced Arrow for the Romans. Now, the full might of Parthia descends upon you. Bombus. 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 Flood in from the west. Is fate testing or dooming me?
specializes in cavalry. Let us feed our enemies their own medicine. <laughs> Power of the Parthian Sultan on this. Alamas, 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 on this. Alamas, on this. On this. Parthian arrows have felled many a Roman. Now we will use archers of our own.
show you barbarians of the West what magnificent culture truly is. and enrich ourselves. are no match for my heavy cavalry. Alamas, Alamas, Humbus, Humbus, Humbus. for a victory.
of India. Through the breach, make our Emperor proud!
children of the age of Trajan, the emperor who found Rome a city of marble and left it one of gold. Ironic, then, that I have no children of my own to tell this tale. I have a loving wife, but in truth, Rome herself has always been the love of my life. Perhaps the gods, in their infinite wisdom deemed the care of children too much for a man who chose an entire empire as his family. Perhaps, as I lie on my deathbed, they are indirectly showing me the way. For years, Rome suffered under the yoke of cruel emperors with no merit other than their bloodline. Like Nerva, I will now choose my successor by merit. And what better choice than Hadrian, the loyal man who walked in my footsteps, learned from my example, and did it all without a single treacherous thought. The afterlife is timeless, immaterial, and boundless. I gaze towards the men tending my funeral pyre and hear them now call me a god. I look out over the forum that I build, the carved column that tells my story, and the city that is an empire's beating heart. I smile, knowing that I have left these people a better Rome than the one that I found. Yet. At the same time, doubt and dread gnaw at me. Now that I have raised the bar, others will try and match it. And their vain ambition, conceit, and impossible expectations could drag Rome towards the same familiar decline from which I rescued it. Was I Rome's savior? Or its doom? Oh, okay. 